right 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 welcome back again so today um i just want to take you through uh the process on how to uh start investing using easy equity which is the broker that i use as well so i want to take you through the, the the platform on how you register um and uh, we'll look at a, at a demo account on how we buy shares of different companies having done your research and your analysis um so let's go through it all right so as we can see here this is their page so to register you'll just go under here on, on, on registering then you'll have to put your name um um I'm just gonna uh, play around since I already have um, the account. So then from here, my mail, the mail, Malibongwe, um, eight, eight, sorry, <laughs> at g mail dot com then my password let me see password i want oh, right. Ish, no no i don't remember this password i put it here okay anyway uh let's make it fast right right then just click next from the, the user already exists uh zero one let's see password needs six characters and we just put another value right let's see mm, password six characters including one number case and lower case right let's do this and see if it's gonna go through yes and it's going through so um, i'm just uh, taking you through this so when you're here you're just gonna fill in your full name and surname nationality and whatsoever um that they need once you confirm so you'll have to go back to your emails uh then you confirm then they take you uh through the link you log into the system so once you are in the system therefore you can um send your 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 id and, and the re, your residential address proof of, re, of, of address uh, also and the bank statement where you, you will be using that bank that you'll be using so then after some a while they first gonna come back to you that you have been figured therefore you can start investing if you like sort of like investing with like the real account account but on a demo account you can be able to play around with a demo account uh even if you're not figured yet but i would advise you to just figure straight away so that when you know the system and you want to um, invest with your real money then you can go through it yes so this is sort of like my dry uh, registration um, on how you register however if you have any question just leave uh, the comment or your questions down down below in the comment section so that i can attend and answer you and help you out throughout the system so as you can see easy offers us a czar account the rand account this is it's free this is the us dollar um real account this is your renew uh, um retirement uh, annuity this is a demo usd demo so today we'll be focusing on the czar demo account so firstly before i dive in let me just go here and show you if you come here you'll get more information on the, the overview the new listing your investment when you want to sell or when you want to deposit however if you just registered you need to figure your account so that you can be able to uh, deposit um uh, your real money uh, obviously you start by learning um it's been two years having this demo um buying and selling just playing around therefore um i felt that i was comfortable uh, uh i then i opt for 
the real account but today let's go and buy one share so first of all you go here invest now wait for it that's all so from here then as we can see we have equities etfs etns the basket and the bundles and crypto i just do another video just explaining what are these because when i started i didn't even know what this what does this mean anyway so if we go to equities so from equities you can see that it shows all or if we want to go for the top 40 which means our top um <clears throat> companies top 40 companies that are listed in the jse e um johannesburg stock exchange here in south africa so then probably let's go and look at the 40 so it will only show top 40 companies so these are companies top 40 companies top 40 companies so if you need more you just click next or last or two so, so this is one of the famous companies in south africa that we know of let's go to next pass obviously uh, what they say is you should invest into something that you understand after having acquired knowledge about investing and the risk that is involved then yeah so then you can go through but for now this is a demo i'm just showing you how you go about and there is equity so from here this is the company but before i just go and jump in and buy what i usually do i come here so that i can actually see what has been happening so we can see starting from here if i click here this is one month in one month nespas has been losing by uh, 4.9 4.95 percent so if you come in, in in longer time frame like three months it's been up and so on and so on so this is the share price yeah, this is the share price guys so however this is the share price um so it it reflects like the this is the last price uh when the market closed uh, la, uh last night then this was the price it, it was at so this is our selling price this is our buying price mind you uh this sort of like um it it it's it delayed by 15 minutes so what we're seeing here uh the price that delayed is you can see here um delayed delayed price so uh, so let's let's jump in and, and go buy. So what I like about shares, as much as this is the share price, which means if you buy um, with this amount of money, you will have one share at Nespas. However, if you do not have sort of like this money, uh, you're just starting out um, on your on your real account. So you can put the value here that you are willing to buy. You can use fifty bucks, guys so yeah so that's the other thing that you can do uh from there therefore you can also use um this section here which has been already written for you uh where there is like 250 where it's 500 and so on so let's let's just use a thousand rand to buy so then we'll go here once off uh, right so as we can see here this is 1000 that we chose this is the actual money that we're buying the shares because of the investment cost that is involved which is all written up here so if you uh, add all these values it will come up to six rand point two one uh, that is costing us to invest so then we invest right so then as we can see we've just bought shares uh since we used 1000 which means we, of which we saw that the share was 2800 therefore here it reflects that we don't have a share we don't have yet that 2000 however let's go and pick up a company that is more or less um uh cheaper uh or trading at, at a lower price at a reasonable price so that we'll see let's look at woolies um okay go up here we we can search worth woolies here we go so this is worth that we can actually go so again 
just want to check what has been happening. It has been going up. Okay, the share is 30. We can we, we have to the, the, the buying price is 34.82. So then we come here. Let's say we use 500. So 500 has been selected. Then you click once off. Um Okay, this is the cost that's costing us. Then we confirm the investment. Here we go. So as you can see, we have 14 shares. We have 14 shares at, at, at Woolies. Then these shares, we bought them at um, 34 bucks. So probably let's take a work calculator and do some calculation. All right. So let's say now we bought the share at 34 bucks. So we bought the share at 34 bucks, we have 14 shares. So if the share price goes higher to 100, many I'm making an example. So how do we calculate how much we're we going to have? So we're going to have, uh, since we have 14 shares times 100. So this is um, this is uh, sort of like the money uh, that we are going to have. Therefore, we can subtract here the money that we invested to see the profit at that time. So if we feel that uh, now, uh, according to our analysis or somehow our research, uh, I think the, the share price it's it, it it has went higher. Probably it's gonna fall for the coming three months or whatsoever up to us either we sell we take the profits or we cut um, a, a certain portion or if we want to sort of like take out the profit okay let's actually go and see one of the shares that have profit i want to show you now when we're taking profit so let's see here Okay, here we have like 6,000. We invested on the S&P tech, right? So let's say now we're like, okay, I need some cash. I need to sell my shares so that I can have cash that is waiting out there just in case I want to buy another stock. So you will come here, sell. So I doubt it's gonna sell because, uh, okay, let's, let's see. So as, as they, can, they tell you that um, this you can actually sell 100%, but you're like, no, we just need money for like, to go and do some stuff. Then we take 50%, we can take 50, can take 30. Then let's see if we can sell. Then we like sell now, we're selling 50% since already we are on profit. So um, yeah then it's just telling us that we have sold so this is the amount of money um that should reflect in our account so as we can see so this is sort of like the money that we have so we can use this money to go and buy maybe another share so that probably we've done our research and we've seen that okay this share it's going to go up or the other thing that is very important when you do when you're investing is to diversify your portfolio what do i mean by that i mean that you have to it has to be balanced as we can see here there's the more of equities so we have to work out a certain percentage that your portfolio has to be, to be balanced because for example if you buy more crypto when the cryptos are going down which means your whole portfolio is going to go down so you need a balance so let's see okay we have sort of like 10 percent of uh, our crypto and probably buy more crypto. So you can do this by having to come here and say invest now, or since because we already we are already owning some crypto, so we'll just have to go down. This is uh, the index for for like crypto. So as you can see, so what you do, say buy more. So again, no, don't forget. We check here how much 21 bucks it's fine we can afford that we have 13 bucks in the bag all right let's probably put five thousand five thousand so this is five thousand then we like buy once
right we need to confirm again this is what is costing us so we like invest now yep so we just bought ourselves uh 227.9855 tokens yeah, so if this goes up therefore then that's it that's that's it guys so this is how you sort of like use easy equity um so however i should put this disclaimer that this is not sort of like a financial advice to go and buy these assets it's sort of like uh, this video is made to show you how to use the easy equity platform so however there's a video that i've made um where uh, i'm starting my tax-free savings uh through easy equity i've put in that video where i really i show like the real money that i'm putting there so the purpose is to start with you guys up until the end as long as you promise that you're gonna be there every time i drop the video which means to do that you have to wait for it you've just said it yes you have to subscribe <laughs> you have to subscribe and share with others even if guys you don't really share with uh with the link or or refer people whatever that i've said if you feel like okay this is valid information you share with others uh you share with others guys because they say knowledge is power again but some say it's potential power once again thank you so much for watching um stay tuned for another videos thank you so much have a great one